Today's astronomy lesson will be short and it is about the natural satellites of Mars. Uh, so first what we can see Mars has two natural satellites but before we begin to find its satellites let's uh, see something interesting. Uh, this is the planet Venus, the planet Earth and planet Mars in a row and planet Venus has zero satellites. Planet Earth has one satellite and Mars has two satellites. How strange is that? Hmm? <laughs> so, what we have to do is to look at these moons at the top and decide which of these ones are actually belonging to Mars. So, the first one is Foep and Foep is not Mars natural satellite. The next one is Europe and it is definitely not a moon of Mars. And the third one is Phobos. And this is the bigger moon of them two of Mars. So here is a little info. Its diameter is around 20 kilometers and it uh, goes around Mars for 7 hours. What uh, else interesting is that uh, if we spend uh, one day on Mars we will see Phobos to go three times in the horizon. So one time, two time, three times and it is a new day. <laughs> So let's continue to look at those uh, natural satellites. Proteus is not Moon, it is not Mars. Callisto is definitely not. Titania is not. Io is not. We are going to Mimas and Hyperion, which are not natural satellites of Mars. And here is Deimos, the second. Mars natural satellite which uh, has orbital rotation of 30 hours. Also Deimos is believed to be a captured ast asteroid from the asteroid belt which is uh, uh, next to Mars between Mars and uh, Jupiter. It's uh, diameter is quite small, around 10 kilometers, which radius is 5 kilometers. So it is the these both moons are different of the moon which have been formed by a hit with the Earth. These asteroids are actually captured asteroids. <laughs> So this is for today, we now know the two natural satellites of Mars and we have a new knowledge level.